I'm, uh, I'm Paul Young from uh, Washington, D.C. Uh, come down here most uh, uh, second and fourth Sundays of each month at Kaboma. This is about five miles from my apartment near DuPont Circle. And uh, I have a mandolin here that's a Gibson uh, replica of a 1923 or 24 Lloyd Lore model Gibson mandolin that became uh, one of the favorite kinds used in bluegrass now. I'm just Frank Vispo and I've just been fiddling around a few years. Uh -huh. uh, it started off, um, I guess, in the military. I, I had uh, played guitar a little bit. And then when I moved to Washington, uh, 1970 around there, I met a fellow that banged him, really a real good country singer and guitar player. And I had a guitar that I had bought in upstate New York and I beat on that with him. And then we met another friend at, uh, where I worked at uh, the Naval Research Lab. And I beat on the guitar for a few years. And then uh, one of the friends um, was from Roanoke, Virginia. He took me to uh, the Galax Fiddle Festival around 1976. And I got fiddle fever. <laughs> fiddle fever! Uh, my name is John Seabach and I live in Bethesda, Maryland um, and I'm playing a 1995 Flatiron Performer F mandolin and I've had it for not quite a year. Mm -hmm. I bought it from a guy in Georgia um, last year. I bought it off eBay actually but rather than have him mail it to me, I was living in Kentucky at the time. I was a little nervous about having an instrument mailed through the, through the post. So I drove down to Georgia and this guy in a parking lot in a grocery store in the middle of nowhere and uh, it looked like some kind of crazy deal gone awry. You know, he opened up his trunk and pulled out the instrument and I handed him the cash and we did the exchange right there. Okay, well uh, my name is Andy Anderson. And uh, I'm from West Virginia, uh -huh. and uh, I've come here, and I uh, uh, lived in uh, Perf uh, lived here in Arlington. I lived here up on Carlin Spring Road in up on Arlington. Uh -huh. Went to school, Washington High School. Went there. When I left here, I went to uh, went to Fairfax Station, and then uh, I left Fairfax Station here just about a month and a half ago. Now I'm living in Annadale with this lady, and I've been playing music all my life. I've been playing the guitar, have one place, been on the radio, been on TV, and done a lot of, mm -hmm. played festivals, I've won in there, and been oh, great. radios and everything. I've been around a long time and playing, so I don't know, I just keep playing. My name's Maurice Stanton. I am from Reston, Virginia. I play an old harmony guitar that's made in 1958. I have it tuned differently from everyone else. It is tuned to a classical C banjo where the first four strings are tuned to the uh, banjo tuning. The fifth string is tuned to a low G. The sixth string is tuned to a low C. And it's a neat instrument has a wonderful tone. My name is Paul Donovan, Springfield, Virginia, and the instrument that I'm playing is a uh, small luthier recreation of a 1923 or 24 Lloyd Lore Gibson mandolin. The original F5 Lloyd Lores were made only two years by uh, the master builder at Gibson, and they are still the standard by which most modern mandolins are measured against today. It uses the scroll styling and the, the bridge style and 
the, uh, the two points that were all part of the original Lloyd Lore F5 design. It's been 10 long years since I My name is Valeria Stewart. I live in Arlington and I'm originally from Argentina and I play the guitar. What by kind ear. of guitar do you play? I play um, an acoustic classical guitar and I just play by ear. So. Oh, all right. <laughs> Hi, I'm Pete Milano and I play the mandolin. I've been playing a uh, Gibson F5 mandolin for about 30 years. and uh, I live in Vienna, Virginia and I play with a group called the Shaw Brothers and Pete Milano. My name is David Shankman and I'm from Southern Maryland, which is about an hour from here. And this banjo I'm playing is a new Stelling banjo that I bought last month. It's a prototype uh, instrument made by the premier banjo maker in the country. Dwayne Thompson. I live in Arlington, Virginia. Been coming to Kermoma since the early started in 1978. I have a Martin D28 guitar from 1973 that I bought used from a guy that never learned to play it. Thought it was a shame that it didn't make any music, so I'm enjoying it very much. Healy. I'm from Vienna, Virginia, originally Washington, D.C. I play guitar. What guitar do you play here? I have a uh, D35 that I'm playing. Well, I'm My name is Vern Freeman, and I'm from uh, uh, Fairfax, Virginia, originally from Texas a long time ago, but done long since moved. And I, I play the mandolin, and I'm, today I'm playing a Gibson uh, 5, F5 mandolin, and I also play the guitar, but I don't have it with me today. And it, Kaboma is a real nice organization for people that love bluegrass and there are plenty of people in Northern Virginia that love bluegrass and I happen to be one of them. I didn't start playing bluegrass until I was about 65 and I'm now 74. <laughs> 